Halloween wouldn't be the same without special effects. So we're gonna take a regular pumpkin and turn it into a smoking cauldron punch bowl. Whenever I carve a pumpkin, I always like to lay down a big piece of butcher paper. You can use newspaper or any other scrap paper. This way it's easy once you're finished scooping out all the guts, you just throw it right away. When you go out shopping for your pumpkin, you wanna make sure that your pumpkins are wide enough and deep enough to hold your metal bowls. We've got three varieties here that will work for your punch bowl. This is a Cinderella pumpkin. You can see it looks like Cinderella's carriage. This is called a cheddar pumpkin. It has that nice, beautiful orange color to it. And this is the most common type of pumpkin and the one that we're gonna to use to make our punch bowl. I'm gonna go about a third of the way down on my pumpkin and I'm gonna cut this all the way around in a circle so that we can take this lid right off. Now the fun part, we get to scoop out all the guts from the pumpkin. Okay, so now we have two metal bowls. You can't use glass or else it will break because we're using dry ice. The dry ice is the special effect, so we need to get this. When it's sold at grocery stores or from a dry ice purveyor, it's always transported in a styrofoam container. And you'll see I'm wearing these pretty gloves because I don't want to get burned. So never handle dry ice with bare hands. So this is what it looks like. And this is exactly how you want it. I'm gonna add it to our larger metal bowl that already has a little bit of water in it. Take our lid off and put our bowl in that has the dry ice. So next, we add the punch. I put my smaller bowl on top, and then I add my punch to it. So there's a space between my small bowl and the bowl that has the dry ice in it. That's there so that I can continue to add water throughout the party. Adding the water is what makes it smoke. I keep a nice little pitcher of water behind my punch bowl throughout the whole party. That way, as I'm walking through the party, I can always add a little bit more for some more smoke. Just to be clear, you wanna add the water to the bowl that has the dry ice, not the bowl that has your punch. This is a kid-friendly punch made with green jello, pineapple juice, and a little bit of club soda. But you can make them adult by simply adding vodka, gin, or rum, whatever's your favorite. Happy Halloween.